Hi friends. I literally just walked in the door from the airport. And I thought I would do a video of like stuff. Souvenirs that I brought back with me and mail that was waiting for me. So let's see, shall we? What's in my purse that I brought back that's fun? Well, I had five pounds, a five pound note that I had to spend, so I got candy. Sherbet lemons and tank plastic. So that's exciting, right? Now look, you're gonna sit there and behave yourselves, okay? And then, bag and I think there's just one thing in here that's new and that is tea the box was in great condition for a long time it got crushed like today this is uh we got this in York it is big surprise Earl Grey And, yeah, that's it. In that, that's my carry-on. Then we got Big Bertha over here. My checked luggage. I don't like flying with checked luggage, but it's hard to go three weeks and carry on. So... Not souvenir, but I did sew two things. So those go with the rest. Now, I tweaked my shoulder. Carrying my heavy bags. Pushing them along. <laughs> so this bag has the more interesting things. Usual assortment of normal things. Oh, here's a thing that might count as a souvenir. Paracetamol. Paracetamol. It's Tylenol, folks. Um, where'd you go? I thought I put you up here. Well, came back with clothes that don't smell like me because they have fabric softener. Basically... Making a big pile of laundry right here. Oh, here's one of my souvenirs. Some cheese. Rhubarb, ginger, and gin. Winsleydale. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Oh. Some packets of Yorkshire tea. Mm hmm A lot of dirty laundry. And I hope you're not seeing. <laughs> oh! Winsleydale and apricots. I got this in Winsleydale. So that's special. It should still be good. Then I got... Nope, those are already mine. Oh, I got a new pair of shoes. I threw those over here. Um, I love my Alberts. I have two pairs. And my feet hurt one day. So I got a third pair. And I got free laces. Okay. And then... I went to the Liberty store in London and I got this little stack of fabrics. They're gonna be quilt fabrics. And then I got, oh yeah. I bought myself a cashmere scarf shawl thing. 
Y'all, the day that I bought this, I was like, ooh, I need it. What month is it? It's very soft and nice and expensive, but I deserved it. And then I got this book that I'm going to send to a friend. And I got a copy of Mansfield Park because my copy of Mansfield Park is small and not easy to read. And then I got a bottle of this Edinburgh Rhubarb and Ginger Gin. And then I also got this bottle of Harrogate Gooseberry, gooseberry gin. And lastly, I got two bottles of ink from a company in Wales. I wish I could say that I went to their store and bought it, but I didn't because it was out of the way, like four hours out of the way. And that was going to be the only thing we were going to do there. And that's silly, you know. It was down in Cardiff and we were up in Snowdonia, which is like the opposite side of the country. And also I have a suitcase full of laundry. Now, mail that was waiting for me. So this I ordered yesterday. Oh, what is it? It's a white noise machine because I took mine to England and it burnt out because of frequencies. I wrote, it's so funny, like I wrote in my journal, hey, it just occurred to me that maybe because of the difference in frequencies of our electrical that maybe this won't work. Then I plugged it in and it was going and then it was not going anymore and it smelled really bad and so then I put it in the bathroom in case it was gonna start a fire. And, Last thing, so I put a hold on my mail. It's gonna all be delivered tomorrow. There might still be, there's gonna be more stuff in it. But this was delivered. Cheeky, and it shouldn't have come. It should have been held. So I ordered this in April. And it came last, week and it is you guys know what this is okay there's a little handwritten thing that says thank you Maria that's nice I got three bottles of ink I got uh so you, can, you know I'm doing swatching video. Not right now because it's the equivalent of, um, well, I don't know. I've been away for 20 hours. So I got Trey Calori Gold Sheen Violet. Kind of hoping it looks a bit like another ink that's super famous. I got one called Glamorous Peacock because that could basically describe me. And... Nebula Space Kitty, because how do you not get an ink called Nebula Space Kitty? I'll tell you, you can't not get it. It's basically the rule that you hear of that ink and you're like, oh, my life is not complete unless I have this. Now, that's everything I got. I'm going to um, set this to upload. And... Um, Take a shower, maybe deal with this mess I made, probably not, and uh, pass out.
That's my plan. Although I may try and stay up till 10, which will be the equivalent of staying up 22 hours. I'm so tired. 